Hi guys, it's Megas here, I hope you're doing well. Today, we are playing the full release of Layers of Fear. It was voted for by my game with supporters. This and Downfall will be the new Let's Players once Spooky Sazer Jump Scares is over. Obviously, yesterday I did finish, I have no mouth and I'm a scream. If you want to get involved and vote which games I play, you can head over to gamewist.com forward slash minx or hit the support me link in the description. For a small monthly amount, you can vote on my next Let's Plays on a regular basis. Anyway, we're going to begin our game of Layers of Fear. Full disclosure, I was provided a copy of the game, as well as a really cool uh, press pack with lots of weird sort of like horrific type stuff in it, which was pretty awesome. But let's see how the actual game is, shall we? Me and Sino played a little bit of this for SOS, and it was one of our favourite games ever on SOS. So let's see how the full version has turned out. I know how you must feel. Lost. Alone. Hopeless. You probably deserve it. But even for you, there is still a way. A way to bring it all back. The one precious thing you ever truly desired. Finish it. Every portrait that is painted with feeling is a portrait of the artist, not of the sitter. Oscar Wilde, the picture of Dorian Gray. It's a good story, the picture of Dorian Gray. Anyway, um, playing this with an Xbox One controller, um, whether or not I'll regret that at some point remains to be seen, but we'll see. Uh, okay. Oh, hello little ratty. Looks like we have just got home. An artist triumph. Gallery opens. Wow's critics. Some call him the new Caravaggio. Others compare him to Van Eyck. But one awesome critic, who wished to remain unnamed, went as far as to invoke the spirit of the great Leonardo. Any way you slice it, the exhibition proved an immense success. Something scratched out. The Sting style has been praised for its unique combination of Renaissance influences and more progressive techniques. The artist himself attended the event in the company of his beautiful fiancée, looking stunning in her black gown. Revealed to us exclusively, the couple are indeed ex... Okay. Very interesting. I didn't really look around much when I played this with Sinnoh. Because, oh god. Wine on the floor there? Not blood, wine. A little storage, got some nice things in jars. Sugar, dead babies, paprika. Beautiful music in this game, by the way. Painting there on the wall, presumably that we've done, I guess. Seeing as we are an artist, boy, I don't know if artists like often hang their own works, and I don't know, you know what I mean. If that would be a normal thing. Stink's been running the whole time. That's kind of weird. Achilles Prosthetics Co. Below knee prosthesis. How the hell did they fuck up the? can't read that. So someone's had a fake leg installed. I don't know if it's us, we can't see our own legs. And they fucked it up. Sir, I didn't touch the workshop just like you asked, although I can't imagine the mess that's inside. Also, if you care so much for that room, maybe you should pay more attention to where you leave the keys. I brought them back to your office. Have a nice day. Okay, so that's a lot right now. That's our office. Oh no, it's our, our workshop. The keys to the workshop are in the office. Very interesting in our little... What the fuck was that noise? Oh, mouse traps. Oh, a load of them went off! Shit, I didn't even see! There must have been a mouse! There's a mouse loose about this hoose. Got like 
old war medals it looks like in there. Shit. That one's locked. Maybe I should look through all of these, can I do that? Very good attention to detail. This game, I said this before probably, but this game makes me feel very much like I'm in an amnesia-like world. And I'm a big fan of those settings. I still consider Amnesia the best horror game ever to be made. Have you read that? Dear Sir, we would like to ask you to cease bothering our pest control specialists, as well as refrain from sending us more of your highly inappropriate letters. I'll have you know that my mother is a respectable woman and does not take kindly to such accusations. All our employees that visited your house reported absolutely no signs of a rodent infestation of any kind, and as such decided not to act further than prophylactic spraying. Please treat this letter as a final warning, or else the next envelope you'll receive will be from our lawyers. With best regards, Carl Denton, Pesky Pets Pacification Co. So, this guy presumably thinks that his house is infested by rats, and has basically uh, been harassing the pest control company to deal with them. Pest control company comes out, says, you're crazy, there's no rats. I think that's the gist of it, right? Some burned music. Beautiful. Not so beautiful. Right, this is our office. I think. What's this one? Be working all night. Don't wake me up. You shut up, please. Galactus Grand opening in flames. Disastrous fire at the new department store leaves dozens fighting for their lives. The long-awaited opening of the Galactic Department Store turned into hell on earth when the building's wiring burst into flames. While the majority of the visitors managed to reach the emergency exits in time, several unfortunate attendees were trapped in the back of the building. Having no chance to escape the raging inferno, the exact number of casualties has not yet been determined, although it's estimated that at least a dozen people have been severely injured. The owner of the Galactic, Ronald Sheffield, has so far declined to comment on today's tragic events. Fan rings and stuff. Soft bed, lovely. I guess that's our cane because we have a prosthetic leg. Sorry, couldn't sleep. The leg's been acting up again. Figured I might well do some work. Love you. Oh, is that his wife's leg? Or is someone else, like a member of his family? I'm not really sure. Someone's definitely been drinking quite a bit, though. That's for fucking sure and certain. And that's locked. Doesn't look too good, that, does it? Right, let's go back to the creepy office. Is there a run button? There's a weird zoom-in button that made me feel violently ill there for a second. But other than that, nothing else. Okay, what do we have here? I actually know what this is. I think this is a picture of the Beast, like one of the original the Beast from Beauty and the Beast. I think it's a betrayal of that. Got a little red riding hood. One of the things they sent me in the press pack was like a little red riding hood and other storybook with these horrific scenes in it. Kind of fucking awesome, but also very disturbing. I'm sorry I'll make it up to you. Tonight it's all about you and me. Let's make it special. You promised. I'm not sure who's writing these notes. If it's me or my partner or whatever. My dear friend, let me ask you one simple question. Have you completely lost your goddamn mind? I know you're going through some hard times right now. I really do. That's why I agreed to let you do these illustrations in the first place. For old times sake. I even deliberately gave you a trivial task because I expected Little Red Riding Hood to be something you can draw in your sleep. Well, I didn't expect to get this demented nightmare fuel you submitted for a kid's bedtime story. There is no way in hell I'm using this. We already regret agreeing to the payment in advance. Please get your shit together. Your old pal, Liam Brixton, Whispered Tower Publishing House. So we drew these for a kid's book? 
This is really fucked up. <laughs> Jesus Christ! I'll teach that little Red Riding Hood to go barging into people's houses, even though it's their own grandma. Shut up! Doesn't matter. Now we have the key, I guess we should go and open our, uh... Oh. Have I been here? No. I'm not sure I want to bow there, but that door's locked. This one, however, isn't. It's our kids' room. So we were married, I guess. And we had a baby. Not sure where everyone is. I don't think left us, and this is just like the remains, or they're missing. It's hard to tell, you know. Daddy, it's Daddy, Mummy, and uh, the Bebe. All having a great time. Those bears are kind of disturbing a little bit. I like stuffed animals, like. I've said it before, <laughs> me and Chris have a ton of stuffed animals, but those are creepy. Hmm, we had a baby girl, it looks like. I don't know. Our electric bill's going to be through the roof with me leaving all these lights on. They were on before I got here as well, which makes it even, like, you know, fucking more expensive. So, you know, you're getting old, by the way. You're like, oh. Can't leave the lights on. The electric bill's going to be too high. That might be a door. Okay, we're going into our study. The tone has distinctly changed. Walking into our, our workshop here. Lots of brushes, lots of fucks brushes, it looks like. Lots of alcohol. Is that alcohol or is it... I'm pretty sure it's it looks like alcohol. It could be something else. It could be oils or something. I don't fucking know. I don't know much about art. The same metals before? Pipe. Paintings. That ominous tone in the air. I know that when I played with Sinnoh, things rapidly went to shit, but we kind of just ran through. I'm so sick and tired of talking through these notes. We live in the same house, for God's sake. Come talk to me when you're done, before you go to sleep. Okay. Mm, it's a smash glass. Pretty disturbing pictures everywhere. Jesus. <laughs> um, not a lot of these things are nice whatsoever. These are all locked up, yeah? yeah. Okay. Let's look at our masterpiece. Well, it's covered up for a reason. Lost. You deserve it. Finish it. Well, I think doing that has probably triggered bad shit to happen in the house. So, let's get ready to be scared, guys. What a surprise. Things have changed. Some really uh, dark artwork they've used for the pictures in this game. Presumably, like, famous bits of dark art. Just... That said, just out of reach or something like that. I can't read it now. Fuck. Can I move this curtain back? Anything in here? And, of course, it's changed yet again. Going in circles. Yeah, damn right I am. And the blood and the wine and all that shit together. Some woman playing the piano. Don't know if that's our wife or just a picture of a woman playing a piano. Scra yeah, Scraps of Love is the achievement I just got there, so presumably that's something to do with that. 
Here we go. Save the date. It was like a wedding thing. Request the pleasure of your company celebrate their wedding on Saturday the 9th of June at St. Luke's Chapel at 2 o'clock in the afternoon. That paint ain't the best paint. So we got married. I can hear you whispering, Chest. I don't know the code. Oh, is it our wedding uh, code? So that would be... Saturday the 9th at 2 o'clock in the afternoon. Saturday is... Is Saturday this, the first day of the week or the sixth day of the week? I always don't know. So 692 could be it, I guess. Or 192. It wants me to know, but I can't, I can't figure it out. Oh, it could be um, the 9th of June, so 962. Yeah, that makes more sense. 960. Oh, what year was it? But the thing is, that's the four fucking... That's four digits, though, if that's it. Nine... June 2 makes sense, I guess. Or. If it's not 962, it could be. 79. Sorry, 692? No. It could be 696, or maybe 196. Let's try that. 696, 196. Okay, guys, sorry, I had to go and have a massive shit. Let's have a look around. Anything else in here? Huh. Um, 548 is obviously the code. Thank you for that. That was a lot easier than what I was trying. There you go, 548. The past holds back. Look closer. The thought alone that the most beautiful piece of art doesn't have my name on it is killing me. So, will you marry me? Oh, that's what he said when he married her. Pretty sure that door wasn't there before, right? Oh god, what the fuck's gonna happen in here? Oh, some fruit. But I can't eat. I don't like the paint on the chair. It's very disconcerting. I don't like the baby in the uh, in the wall there. Ah! Are you fucking kidding me? My love, even though you've not born, been born yet, I can feel already your presence. It's simply amazing. I just can't believe how lucky I am. A year ago, all I had was talent and ambition. Now, against all odds, I have a career, a loving husband, and you. I've never been a deeply religious person. I guess what other people look at for in sermon, I found in perfecting my art. But now I can't help but feel like there's a higher power watching over me. They once told me that I would never succeed as a musician. Now I'm playing solo at concerts at some of the most prestigious venues in the country. They also said I had a difficult character and I would never find a soulmate. Guess again. Finally a doctor once told me that I would never be able to have children of my own. And yet here you are, within me. I am quite possibly the happiest woman in the world. I love you so much. Oh. Well, it, you can also read it like that, but I didn't know that. So, you know, that's good. It's really fucking dark in here. Oh, fuck, I forgot about the... Run. Run. Down the rabbit hole. Couldn't that say rabbit? Instead of, instead of rabid? 
fuck me. Me and I didn't get that far in this, so I guess we'll just see what happens as things unfold. You! I know you! You're the one attacking me a minute ago! I saw you with your stupid fucking red hair, Clive! You want some? I'm a fucking famous painter, you know. Hang on, isn't this the room I was in when I fell through the floor? But now the doll's gone. Some dominoes. Oh, thank, thanks. I'm leaving now. Yeah, this is definitely new. Oh, fuck. Paint deep lies. Now, a tiny bit to the left. Yes, just like that. Hold that pose. I want to get all those lovely curves just right. <laughs> Jesus fucking Christ. I need to get out of here now. Oh my god, that was pretty intense. I'm sure there's more intenseness to come. A rat just ran into the fire and got burned alive. I told them we had a rat! The rat keeps running into the fire and getting burned alive. Jesus Christ. Stop it! Shut up! Oh! Oh! Oh. Ah! <laughs> oh. oh fucking It's not your fault. Fucking stupid bust I'm gonna I'm gonna leave the room now. Hang on, I just noticed. I'm walking with a limp. So I'm the one with the prosthetic leg, I guess. Okay. I wasn't sure if it was me or my wife, but it looks definitely like it's me with my prosthetic leg. When I wobble around. Interesting to know. How oh god. Hello. It's about time for us to talk, don't you uh, I'd think? rather we didn't. I mean, I've seen you in my house so many times, and yet I could never find the courage to face you directly. Not until now. Okay. Well, I'd rather not. I'm sorry. I'm sorry you're crying, but I can't go in. It's just like some PT shit. It's a shame that game will never be. Oh god. We're in the wine cellar. Or something like that. Um. Hello? Was that me? Oh, oh, oh. Yeah, it's me. Okay. Whew. First step is the hardest. Great. Well, I'll bear that in mind. The atmosphere in here is not numb. Anything in the ovens? Come on, they can't be locked. I'm gonna say. They ain't locked ovens. If I do that, I'm pretty impressed. Hello? Hello? Um. Ah! Oh, fuck me. I hate you! 
Although I am hungry, so thank you for all the food. First, I looked for a canvas. Not just any canvas. I had to find a knife. Not one of those bread ones. It needed to be as sharp as a razor. So I used a razor, in fact, and then carefully flayed the skin. Booze helped keep my hand steady. Oh, that's not... The painting's physically changed. Can I just leave through this door? I'm back in here. What could go wrong, huh? There you go, I put that back in the painting. I will finish it. Or something. See? Finish it. See? Flamingos. Everyone li likes flamingos. Hi. You guys alright? Okay, I'm gonna go now. This is new, right? Oh, it's photos that I f you can find lying around the house. I presumably have missed a shit ton of stuff. It's like a scrapbook of things that you can find. Interesting. Okay. I'm trying to be quite attentive. Deep breaths, remember, you're professional. It's not just the first strokes, then you're over the hump. What's so hard about it? Pretty sure I've written that before, but... First, I looked for a canvas. Not just any canvas. I had to find a knife. Not one of those bread ones. It needs to be as sharp as a razor. So I used a razor, in fact, and then carefully flayed the skin. Booze helped keep my hands steady. Oh, so that's from before. So we put a piece of my own skin in here? I guess this is going to slowly unlock and reveal the different sections. That was just section one. Shapeless dreams. And we'll come back here in between each section. Okay, that's really cool. Hi guys, it's Mix here. Hope you're doing well. I am doing fine, thank you. Just want to thank you for watching my Layers of Fear video. If you enjoyed this, please give it a thumbs up. It really means a lot to see the likes in the video, and as these don't do too well, giving it some likes will boost traffic and help me out, and uh, yeah, it's awesome if you do. So thank you very much in advance if you do choose to leave a like. I also would like to thank my Gamer supporter for bringing you this video as per usual. Thank you very much, Zaku. It's really awesome to have your support for yet another month, so thank you very much for your support. It really means a lot, and I really, really, really really appreciate it. So thank you very much for supporting me, Zaki. I hope you have a great fucking day, and um, I hope everyone watched this enjoyed the video. If you want to support me, you can head over to gamewist.com forward slash minx by hitting that link in the description right now, the support me link as well, and you can get a shout out of your very own should you wish to do so. Thanks once again, Zaki. You really are fucking awesome, and I'll see the rest of you really soon. Have a great day. Bye for now.